We have about 1.9 million acres of, of land is under the management of, the, of Sierra Pacific. We're a wood products company. The timberline and the wood is really the resource that underpins Sierra Pacific and helps us to generate value so that we can hire people and pay them good wages. It's great to, to work for a company that's not just proud of what we do, but also proud of our areas that we're in and being thankful for the folks that do come and work for us and having that culture and caring for one another to make sure we go home safe every day. We have a very long-term approach to our business. We're planting trees that I won't see harvested, maybe even some of my children won't see harvested, but we truly are a long-term thinking company. I'm very proud to be here. One of the values of Sierra Pacific is to grow our people. We really want to be making opportunities for our employees, move them up in the ranks, and you know, grow the company in that way. My name's Joseph Cheney. I'm a certified lumber grader. I inspect lumber in line, so as it gets surfaced and finished through the planer, I do the final inspections before it goes to be shipped. For someone who is planning on starting a career here, just come in open-minded, just be positive, and don't be afraid to ask questions. I was nervous when I came over the first time and got my interview and everything, but you have to make some choices sometimes. You have to step forward and, and do it. What I thought was a little window become a huge garage door. It was awesome. We can teach all the skills, but we can't teach intelligence and we can't teach a passion for, for wanting to do the work. So that's what we're looking for in a person, people that are excited about what they do, have good attitudes, are able to pick things up. They don't have to have all those technical skills ahead of time. The number one characteristic that we look for in people is that they value a hard day's work and they do things with integrity and do things the Sierra Pacific way of doing things. Sierra Pacific absolutely recognizes college degrees, but we also recognize that there's a lot of smart people who don't have college degrees, and just because you don't have a college degree doesn't mean that you can't do the job. We're really growing for us for the future, and we're doing it the right way. I think that's something that every employee can be proud of. I mean, we're actually in a business that's, that is sustainable. We can go out there and harvest trees, replant, and in a period of you know, anywhere from 40 to 60 to 80 years, depending upon the site, go back and harvest again. Everything's so long term. Our, our mills are to provide steady jobs forever. Our forests are gonna have more wood than they do now in the future. Everything is looked at in 100 year cycles instead of one year rotation cycles. So it's really fun to watch a company that's really forward thinking like that, always making investments in both land and mills. We are stewards of the environment, probably more so than a lot of people think we are, because it is, it's our livelihood. When I first moved up here, I was like, whoa, <laughs> it's beautiful up here. This is where someone can retire. My name is Louise Marie Garcia, and I'm a stacker operator. I like my job, I really do. You know, I do my job, as long as I do a good job, I'm good, and I'm happy where I'm at. It's a good place to work for, to raise a family. I am Vashon Atkinson, and I am a salesman in the sales department. I went to my younger brother's that also works for Sierra Pacific, I looked on the bar stool, and I seen his pay stamp. I was like, wow, you're making that kind of money? He goes, yeah. And I said, well, the next time they're hiring, then you let me know. That was 14 years ago, and so that's how I got started. You almost control your own destiny, you know, by what do you want to do? Do you want to be a saw filer? you want to be an electrician? you want to be a millwright? Do you want to become a supervisor? One day, do you want to be a plant manager? In so many ways, you control your own destiny by the work you put in, learning, you know, the knowledge you gain. If you push yourself, not only if you get hired from Windows, you can go transfer to the mill, you know, I mean, it's everywhere. You want to go live in Washington, you can go to Washington. My name is Matt Henderson, and my actual title is uh, Shipping Support. I work in the warehouse, so I load uh, daily trucks to all the different mills with uh, shipping supplies, paper, banding, uh, whatever the fab shop's made, so it changes daily. The benefits are a, a huge factor, you know, especially with kids and, you know, health needs and all that, so that's a big number, but uh, just steady employment is, is a big thing. We have a pretty aggressive program of posting 
pretty much every position in the company. The purpose for doing that is that we want to encourage people that are interested in applying more and growing with the company and taking on more, more responsibilities. You know, there's a lot of other things that um, we provide for people. Uh, one of them is scholarships, giving their kids the ability to uh, get an education and go do something they want to do. What I'm most proud about the foundation is the scholarship program. I think total now we're somewhere around six million dollars in scholarships that we've granted. I mean, Sierra Pacific pays competitive wages. They've got an excellent benefit program. The premiums are extremely low. If you look at the whole package overall, that's really what's attractive about Sierra Pacific. Our window division is very exciting. We acquired another company in 2014 and have really expanded. Now we have a national presence. Our window company is going to grow dramatically in the next short period of time. We have a lot to be gained internally by having somebody from one facility move to another facility. You know, they bring their experiences from what they had before and they're looking at things with a fresh set of eyes and that's very valuable to us. When you add our sales force into it, I mean, there's literally opportunities everywhere in the country, from Florida to Washington, from Southern California to Maine. Even where we don't necessarily have operations, we've got salespeople in the field promoting our product. My name's Matthew Widener, purchasing and warehouse. My dad, he's worked here for 28 years. My brother, he's been working here for six years at the truck shop. I came out, graduated high school, waited until I was 18, saw a drop over and applied and just kind of staying with it. The company's been huge for my whole family and possibly maybe even my kids one day. My name is Jolene Baskowski and I'm a laborer. You can feel the value within the way that they communicate with their employees and you feel welcomed and they appreciate their employees and letting you know that you are valued and that's important. Jack F. Hogan Jr., I'm a prime line operator. Okay, my uh, oldest works upstairs and my son is a molder operator on swing at Miller. If I didn't feel secure for my family to be here through the Emersons, then I wouldn't have asked them to come to work with us. It's raised them and now it's raising their kids. So now we're three generations into this. So I think it's fantastic. The individuals that own this company, one of the real strengths is that they are involved in their business every day. They're completely committed and they're up early and they're working hard and you can get an answer and you can get feedback because they're here and directly involved. Th this company has some things that are really unique about it. Uh, the company's like family uh, from the top to the bottom. You know, a lot of people don't realize how big this company is and how, how much everybody from each division is willing to help every other division. People come in from the outside, they don't realize they can pick up a phone and have 4,000 people to help. When I joined in 1978, we had somewhere around like 900 folks working here. Today we have right at 5,000. No one division can, can survive without the success, support, and contribution of the other divisions. My name is Alex Dietz, and I do specialty lumber sales at Sierra Pacific. We really like to support the communities around our mills just because we couldn't run them without the people. You know, we want to let employees know that we appreciate them and that we want to support not only them, but their families as well. We're not a company of numbers. We're a company of people. I think it comes from Red Emerson. I mean, it's, uh, he recognizes everybody and his greatest asset is the people that work for him. You can have a job here or you can have a career. We truly provide careers for folks that don't have a fancy degree or even a lot of experience. Someone can start at the basic job here and end up being a manager of one of our divisions. This is my oldest daughter, Nikki. Hi. And uh, she works here too. It is a great place to work. Not every job you come to work knowing that you love your job. And I love my job. I love the people I work with. I believe in what we do. It's important and it makes a difference. It's more than just working here. You know, you, you know their families, you know what they do, you know their kids play baseball. It's definitely a family operation. Everybody's involved. The success of our company has been hiring good people. Uh, we've got some people that have been with us over 40 years here. But having your own sons working with you, it's a different feeling of trust. And uh, we've had some awfully good employees, I mean, that uh, 
were trustworthy and uh, they say, well, if I take care of the company, the company will take care of me. But I like people bigger that think that way because I, we want to take care of our people.